I am excited and a little nervous. Wait, is this your first film festival? No, it's not. And it doesn't get better with time. It doesn't. It doesn't get better. I'm just nervous. It's been a year of work, and we want people to like it. So So tell me, what is it about? The Wrong Guy is a dark comedy about a guy who thinks he's like the world's best vigilante, but he's a buffoon. And he always takes revenge on people that wrong him, but it turns out that he double-crossed the wrong person this time. Ooh. An FBI agent. So it's a thriller. How, how long it is? 21 minutes. Yeah. For a short? That's like long short. We wanted to give you guys the biggest roller coaster in 20 minutes you can possibly have. So hopefully we did that. How many days of shooting? Four. Oh, wow. That was pretty fast. Damn, you're good. Thank you. And I did it remotely because I had COVID. No way. No <laughs> way. Oh, my God. So we're really excited because we're like, okay, well, all the, all the polishing you can do is done. Now it's let the movie do its own thing. Okay, so how important is to have a mentor in this industry? 100%. Person. What have you learned from your mentors? Damn, uh, to take it easy, to do the, jo the job right, don't take shit, don't take things too personally, have a thicker skin, and have fun with it, man. That's the whole point. Well, congratulations Thank from you. being here. We are so excited. And my last thing, because my YouTube channel is called What the Hell Did She Say? is to hear your Spanish, which is going to be easy for you. Easy. Uh, what, what do I say? I, I can, what do I say in Spanish? Whatever you want. Invite the audience to see your film. Um, síganos en Push Start Films en Instagram, Alejandro Montoya Marín. Y este, so, apoyen al cine independiente. Y no favor. anden de malos. Anden de gachos, vato. Por favor. Gracias. Muchas gracias a ti. The Wrong Guy is a short film that Alejandro Montoya Marin and I, we wrote together. We shot it two months later during COVID. We had Kirk Fox, Jamie Bernadette, Matt Page, and myself in it. And um, it's a dark comedy, which I think everybody's going to really enjoy tonight. And are you the wrong guy? or? W you'll have to come and see. <laughs> <laughs> what was the most challenging thing, other than COVID, uh, of shooting this character? Um... Producing, writing, and starring in it, you know, it becomes a juggling act when you're on set and things don't go as planned. So, you know, just kind of doing the producing while starring in it, you got to have a good team. So. Look, if Mel Gibson can do it, also you can do it, oh, right? yeah. Big fan <laughs> of Mel Gibson. We love him. My last thing. I am from Mexico, so I want to hear your Spanish. Okay. Um, hola. Hola, mucho um, gusto. I invite them to see your film. So, vengan a ver. Venga, va a ver. El hombre. El hombre. Tu cato. Gracias. Hey, gracias. No mami, wey. I'm Paul Casanova, I'm a songwriter, and I work with Alejandro on some of his films. Most of his films we do different music and so forth. He's got some great movies coming out, uh, this is one of them. And so I'm just excited to be part of it and be part of write, writing songs with him. He's a great director and I'm really looking forward to doing more with him. So what's the difference between just writing regular songs, right, and writing for a movie? Writing for a movie is a little different because a lot of times you have to deal with the topic. You know, sometimes you have to put it within a frame and you have to sort of generalize what you're going to do. And it depends on what the director wants. Sometimes you might want an instrumental, which is kind of give you the vibe behind the scene. Sometimes you want something to drive the scene, maybe throw, so, throw some words out that kind of suggest what's supposed to happen in the scene. So it's different. When you're doing a regular song, you're going straight from inspiration and you're just writing something. You're just like, oh, I need to write a song. Like, I want to write a jumpy song. I want to write this kind of song, that kind of thing. So two different tired crafts, but if you confuse them together, you've got it right. Nice. Well, my last thing is I want to hear your Spanish because I am from Mexico. Oh, yo soy de Colombia. Ah, que viva que los que Latinos. <laughs> que bien, que rico. Que padre. Muchísimas felicidades por estar en el festival de... Bailando con las películas. Sí, eh, sí, eh, sí, así se, me parece que así se llama. Bueno, muchas gracias. No lo inventamos. Suerte. Adiós. Sí, chao. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, find me on Facebook, follow me on Instagram, and thank you so much for your support. Hello. How are you today?